kind of hotly contested because there's no one wolf who's really shown themselves to be the most dominant yeah. and plays them consistently. So let's see. Let's see if Larry can get his revenge on Jackal or uh, we're going to see more or less the same stuff. I don't really see this matchup that much. Like, even when he was super common in the meta, I didn't really see that many wolf titles. Yeah, I've seen. I've, the thing is, is that uh, Larry recently. I think played against Charlie the King. Oh at, yeah, yeah. They at, played at Super Smash Bros. Yeah. Yeah. He beat Charlie like 3-1 or something like that. Yeah. It, it was pretty reasonable. And Larry's kind of shown that he's decently proficient in the matchup. I think it's just a you know a player matchup more yeah. so than anything. For sure. This is oh, that's so scary because the Wolf Flash does not snap. So I feel like Wolf can destroy his own recovery really well. Absolutely. Like F tilt, down smash. And that felt so safe that. too, that's the big thing, right? Yeah. Oh my god, max range. Good. That was like the only way you could have punished that. Parry. Uh, he's dead. Oh yeah, he caught the jump. Yeah. Nice laser snipe. That's another thing that Wolf has to watch out. It's just a lot. It's like a typical Spacey's matchup where yeah. like they destroy each other really well, you know? Tech chase here? Oh, nice jump away from there. That weak nair is so scary for Wolf. Oh, this should be a tech chase. Nice. Ooh. Yeah, caught the uh, air dodge in. Yeah. Yeah, Larry's actually, well, any good wolf, but like Larry's especially is very proficient with tech chases. He's also kind of really keyed oh. into defensive habits. You know, he, he, he loves to let you think that you're safe doing an option, and then all of a sudden he starts to punish it, and then you're thinking, you know, you have to change your whole game plan. Yeah. Larry calls that the long con. He has a lot of tricks that he saves, like, specifically for, like, last hit scenario. Right. Where he hasn't done it before. Oh, oh, nice. He should be dead here, he right? Did, I think he needed it. Oh. Okay. Oh, no. That's, yeah. He held down there. Great stuff from Jackal. Oh, man. Oh, wait, I'm tripping. I thought Larry hit him with his up no. <laughs> no. <laughs> like, That was really so tragic for Jackal. Okay, well, Wolf does massive amounts of damage, especially at low percent. So uh, I can see Jackal definitely turn this game around real quick. Okay, Larry trying to bully him to the corner of the stage. Great fair into Wolf Flash. He caught him right before his... Uh, Smash animation came out. I like the yeah, up smash yeah. attempt. That would have covered roll if Larry had committed to that. But charged it a little bit too long. Nice. Jack okay. has been so patient at the ledge. That's kind of what's allowing oh. him to get so many of these reversal situations that we're seeing. Free hair? Oh, yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, untackable. But I like the slight delay from Jack. We just barely missed time that edge guard, though. He knew exactly what Larry was going for. Oh, weak Nair. Okay, he's out wow. here. Oh, okay. wait. Let me fix my face. Larry has the eye of God. And holds down just slightly on the Wolf Flash to hit him through the ledge. Yeah, unsafe for it till back throw. No. If he was closer to the ledge, probably would have killed there. Oh, man. Right before the F-Tilt came out, weak dash attack's not going to kill either. Okay. Oh, uh, no F-Tilt. That was free kill. Nice. Dang, that kill at the top. Yeah. No, that... that Dash Dak has got so many weird, interesting hitboxes on it that, you know, you never really know where oh. you're going to need the DI. Here comes Jackal. Clean low percent combo, putting Larry in a really bad spot at the ledge. Okay. Situation's reverse here, but uh, interesting that he goes for, like, the up throw instead of just going for some, like, offstage play with, like, the forward throw. But yeah, that's interesting. I think he's saving the forward throw because he likes to do forward throw into pivot cancel left throw. That's like his game. All right, very scary situation here for Jackal, but again, really good patience out the ledge, keeping him alive longer than Larry would like. Oh, he caught the jump, though. What's he gonna do with the ledge? He has no more invincibility, but Larry does not want to give up stage control. Yeah, overextending here could mean the game, so Larry just playing so patient. Jackal is at such a high percent, he could die to a back throw oh, the ledge. Oh, great there. Oh, man, good tech roll away, but that's a late back there. Just barely cutting off the side. Really, really close game. We're just gonna run it right back to PS2. Very close, very close. Yeah, I love that, that like, kind of, it's almost like you're just expecting them to throw out an option, so you just, you jump up, because you know they want to press a button. Mm. And then, when you fall with an aerial, you're always punishing the lag that they just thrown something out with. And so, it, he just kind of read that Jackal was going to, you know, try to hit him right there, and, you know, push himself back into the advantage, and, you know, Larry punished him really well with, it, with that back air. We're going to see the Wolf Ditto again on PS2. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like if anyone's going to be the one to counterpick a stage, it's going to be uh, Larry here. We'll see. Uh, Larry kind of started with the lead for the most of that game, but Jackie was, Jack was definitely turning it up towards the end. So I feel like if he just keeps that same hotness from the end of that game, he can really just kind of run over Larry here. He's kind of seen that already. 
Really big start for Deco right now. Yeah, but all it takes is that one interaction win for Larry to bring his back as far as the percent goes. Tech Chase? Nice. Wow. He's really good at getting these like, weak in there follow-ups. Oh, and caught the jump immediately. Damn. Jackal, big lead here. Only took 28%. I think Larry only hit him like two or three times that whole stop. Yeah, he didn't really have a chance to speak back, and Jackal's been doing such a great job of just being oppressive. Yeah. Yeah, he knows when Larry wants to shield too. He's just like literally walking in his face and just grabbing him for free most of the time. Tech chase. Nice. After he caught the jump. Oh, yeah. He, Larry knew he could not go for a wolf flash there. That would have been a free down smash. Okay. Situation for Larry here. How, how, how long can he keep Jackal the ledge? Nice. Great forward air from the ledge to the back there. Really good hit confirmed for that wolf has. He can kill at the ledge too at a super early percent. Jackal. Another one. Oh. You've yeah, seen so many weak nares. Like, Larry's just slightly mistiming his punish, but there's the anti air. Yeah, the pancake from the up smash. Kind yeah. Of just making sure that Larry was going to stay safe that whole time. Yeah, Wolf gets to, like, get some free whip punishes on, like, falling aerials with that. Tech chase uh -oh. here. Oh, oh no tech. Man. Yeah, that covered tech in and uh, no tech, as well as tech in place. Just tech in place in this game is so bad. Yeah. It's basically just a delayed moment get up. Yep. All right, Larry trying to start up Ooh. something here. Nice. Did he catch the jump? Yep, oh that's it. my gosh. Dang, Larry off a of one neutral win. That's what Turned I'm saying. into a stock. That's what I'm saying. That's the power of Wolf. All right, let's see if we can get another last down to the wire game here. Catch the air dodge. Go for another tech chase. No, a little bit too risky on that dash attack. Kind of on the bad position on the platform here, but very good patience. Oh my god, these guys are just swinging back and forth. Both have such good spacing in the ditto. Oh, he fell out. Yeah, just barely off with the spacing on the roll get up attack. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Jackal has him at the ledge. Unsafe forward air. He's going to set up the ledge pressure once again. Oh. Nice. Gets another opportunity for a tech chase here. Uh, oh. Barely living. Oh my god, barely avoids that up there. This is so close. And this is a really similar situation to what we saw last game with the roll to reverse, right? I thought Larry would go for a fair wolf flash, but from center stage, dash tech's gonna kill Larry. Again, it's like a, literally a reverse of the last game, right? Yeah. The person starts out with a big lead, but then towards the end, just start you know, gaining the momentum and just look like Larry's gonna make that comeback happen, but exactly. that'll close that one out. Yeah, so I mean, it'd be interesting to see if Larry's able to take that momentum into the next game like yep. Jackal did. Yeah, exactly. Jackal had a big first stock too. He only took like 28% on his first stock before he killed Larry. Crazy. I didn't see what Larry counterpicked. I don't know if he decided I to go back. Ran it back. Oh, wow, well, both of them are running it back. Yeah. Dang. This is a PS2 set. Yeah, I mean, it's the ditto, so at this point, like, the stage pick is just personal preference at this point, you know? Yeah, these guys are just so close to the kill, man. Just going back and forth. Yeah, and it's really interesting to see how they take different combo tricks. Like, you don't see them both doing the same things to each other, they're doing different things. And I think that's what's the most interesting thing about Wolf is because he has so much hits done and so many of his moves. He can be really creative with DI mix ups and all the different uh, ways they use it. Yeah, exactly. Nice low. Oh, he still caught the upbeat? Yeah, he's oh, dead now. I think. Wow. Oh, air dodge. Okay. Oh, that's it. Nice. Larry recognizing that he still had some resources to recover there, closing out the stock with the off stage nair. Really clean stuff, but he's very close to dying here. Another fair from ledge. He's only gotten some reward for that, but he's also gotten punished quite a few times. Surprised Jackal didn't get with that one. Yeah, and the tech chasing has been on point for Larry as well. That's why he's able to rack up all his percent after taking that first stock. And Jackal, he's kind of just, oh. I was going to say, he's searching for that option, and there it was. Good anti-air really good, from him. Yeah, really good anti-air. And it was like the tip of the up smash, too. Just barely caught Larry's drift in. Yeah, Larry was hoping to go in with a fairer in there. And him up, caught his leg. Oh? Oh, I thought he would go for the, uh, like a dare or something. Like that falling fair at that percent is very dangerous. But big back air sent him off the stage. And Larry again gets away with the ledge jump fair. Uh, Jackal has not really punished him for that in this game so yeah, far. Yeah, he's trying to contest it. That's what it's yeah. been. He's, he's trying to find a way to like oh, punish it. Wow, what? Yeah, that move scoops behind. Larry thought he was safe with the cross of Nair, but. That uh, anti-air up smash from Jackal again, and coming Jack in clutch. He's turned this game around oh. completely. Yeah, very good stuff here. Oh. Keeping it super clutch. 
Oh, no. And, yeah, Larry's just searching for his kill. He doesn't want to fall too behind, but Jackal is just whip punishing him over and over. You see the slight dash back punish the dash attack from Larry. It might be a potential two stock here. Oh, he tried to get him with his own master. Oh, and okay. he dies for it. It is Jackal. You don't gonna, is he want too big that, for his riches? Who knows? You don't want that to be the start of a comeback for Larry. But the tech chase. it's what's Wolf, man. This guy's damage output is insane. Yeah, one hit could lead to the stocks for Larry Lur. Oh, nice late there. Oh, man, goes off the top. Very scary position to be in. Nice. Sees the, sees the at such a high percent, the threat of the grab is even stronger there. Yeah. Nice. Oh, Caught the landing of the dash attack and now close out. What an angle. Yeah. Great landing trap. Seeing Larry uh, running out of jumps, running out of places to retreat to, just catches his uh, landing with the dash attack. A lot of people just do that in general. Like when they don't have that much ways to uh, land safely, they just try to retreat to the ledge. Right. Get some invincibility frames. But Jackal caught that before he can even pull it off. Might just be a all PS2 set. Yeah. For, uh, for Larry here. More than likely. And we are going into game no. number four. Oh, oh, okay. We're going to Battlefield. Game four. Changing things up. Yeah, Larry uh, saying, you know what? You got that one. You got PS2. Let's go somewhere else. Okay, Larry. Uh, another chance here to bring it to a game five and get his revenge on Jackal, who did uh, send him to the loser's bracket at Big House. I think it was 3-1. Not too sure. But yeah, seeing how this set's going, just, I can see how you know Jackal was able to get that first set win. Yeah. He's like adapted so hard. I, if anything, like he just turned up the Jets. You know, he was already playing at a really high level from the first few games. Oh, the movement! Yeah, he's just been slightly like whip punching Larry to it, like that dash back. But he's got to be really careful with uh, how he's holding in on this. Like he tried to go for it again. Yeah. It seems like Wolf is really good at fighting out of the disadvantage, like out of the corner, against Wolf. Oh, for, yeah, for, for sure. Like, his hitboxes off the ledge are kind of, like, really, really good for contesting what Wolf wants to do with the ledge as well. And that F-tilt for Jackal is going to seal that third, or first stock out. And what the heck is Larry doing? Yeah, Larry going for some Hail Mary plays to get this stock off without falling too far behind. And we kind of saw that in the last game. Got a little bit thirsty for the kill, and that led Jackal rack up a lot of free percent. Oh, falling out of the up tilt. Don't want to see that at this point, especially when you're searching for this stock. But man, Jackal calling out the jump as well. Ooh, I wouldn't like to see an up be straight up. Maybe it could have killed. Oh, not sure. oh my gosh, the whip punishing his space. Jackal's spacing is just right outside of range. And before Larry can even think of landing, he's already out of here. Not even taking Jackal's first stock, two stocks behind. This is looking so rough. And Jackal finally, no, he's still alive. Oh, there it is. Yeah, Larry needs a big stock right now to even this up. And yeah, you've seen him do it. Yeah, I, we have, but this is like the biggest lead that Jekyll's had in the whole set so far. Oh, man. Still applying so much pressure. Oh. What a brave forward air. Jackal saying no game fives. Suddenly, Larry finally starting to speak back. He's putting some percent on, but is it enough, really, is the question. Yeah. Yeah, he, nice angle. Of the he had already committed to the down smash, just went straight for the side piece. Oh, too late on the down smash. He doesn't catch the roll in either. Still able to cover it, though. Close to dying here. Almost gets the landing trapped by that up tilt. Interesting stuff. Oh, that's good. The that's the Larry Lurd. Yeah, but good awareness from Jackal knowing that that setup was coming. He already teched in place. Oh. Nope, too late. Yeah. Oh, is. caught the drift away. All right, Larry. Uh, this is it's still doable, but not going to be easy at all. Jackal spacing is so scary right now. And you can tell exactly what he wants. He's throwing out these back airs, but nice. the moment that he stops throwing these back airs out, he could be throwing out an option that Larry is unprepared for. So he's got to keep everything on the table. Oh, man, that backer barely missed. Catch the roll of the jab. Oh, oh. the weak nair. Jackal looked like he was waiting for that. Bad spot at the ledge. Gotta watch out for the oh, oh, dash nice. attack. The dash attack has really been what has sealed the games out for Jackal so far. Yeah, so close here. Jackal staying so patient and neutral. Just waiting for the slight misstep oh. from Larry. That was a great empty hop into the grab. Jackal unprepared for that. Oh. There's the nair. Can he keep him in disadvantage? Oh, he went high. Interesting. There's oh. another dash attack. 
Not the best DI on that either. Oh, wow. the F tilt two frame. Larry. He hit him with the tips of his fingernails, yes. dude. That was oh crazy. my god. The max range F tilt and the perfect timing before the LB can even grab the ledge. He was standing so far away. Jeez. That two frame literally kept Larry in this set. What a huge comeback from Larry. I honestly. If I'm being honest, I kind of counted him out there. I thought I, that was yeah. all Jackal. Especially the way he was facing, like Jackal was taking no risk. Really, like really, he was not taking that many risks at all. He turned on the Jets, man. Larry has been known to do some crazy stuff, but we are on Smashville here in game five. Yeah, Jackal finally using a counter pick too. Yeah, this is winner's finals of the pool. Winner makes it into top 24 guaranteed. Yeah, and if you're Jackal, you know, already beat Larry before, you don't want to, you know, drop a set to someone that you know you have the potential to beat. But this is going to the wire here. Game five, last hit situation. Yeah, and in this one, they're oh. super even. It's been back and forth between these two. Man, Larry's legend affairs. I don't know. I guess Jackal's just not ready for them. I'm telling you, I think, I think Wolf is just really good at getting off ledge against Wolf. Yeah, but I feel like if Jackal's ready, he could just anti-air up smash that, like, immediately. Right. Oh! Okay. Nope, we're barely living. I felt again. Look at the range that Larry's standing at. He's so far away. Committing nothing, space-wise. Oh, but his connects. Yeah, anything you can do, I can do. Yeah. I haven't actually seen Jackal get that that much. The up tilt on the upbeat. I think that might be the first time. Oh! oh. There's the, okay, I was expecting to go down and get him, but Larry not risking it. Yeah, I thought that would be like an offstage uh, Nair that drops on there. The issue is like, if he goes out and he gets the Nair and he kills him with it, he actually comes back and he's into the van. Oh yeah, it's true, because he has to get back on stage. And it's going to take a while. And in that time, Jackal has come down from the Angel platform. But since then, Jackal has been put on so much percent. Finally, Larry going to take that stock. Yeah, but back it took 60 though. Oh, he didn't get the sweet spot back. I think that might have killed if he got the right hit. Oh, that was so risky to he go. He held down. Yeah, too. he held down on a down smash. That could have actually hit his foot. And I think Larry is a little bit now more privy to the spacing on Jackal's back airs that he's throwing out at the ledge. He's kind of not getting hit by any of them. Jackal's been so patient just throwing out those back airs, hoping Larry's going to oh. jump into them. No way. Oh, wow. no. Jackal, I don't know if he wanted that directional air dodge. And that could be the defining moment of this set. I mean, it, these two have been playing so close and not making any mistakes up until this point. Oh, man. Larry's racking up so much percent, too. I think he smells blood in the water right now. Oh, oh no. Jackal's oh. playing super scared. He's holding shield. Yeah, he's air dodging a lot, too. But okay. that back air just barely missing. He's going to whiff punch with the up smash. 71%. Larry brought this back to see if Jackal can do the same thing here. Oh. oh. Uh-oh, he's in a rough spot oh. off stage. Oh, my God. He's, if he did it a little bit early, it would have caught the wolf bash. Yeah, if he went right for it, oh. he charged it. Wait, hold up. Comes Jackal. Yeah, he's back in it. Oh. He's kind of moving a little bit, too, but now Larry's got the advantage. Oh. Good angle on the up beat. Oh, he hold up. up air. Bad trade for Larry. He's in a terrible spot off stage. Stalls his up beat just to avoid the ledge pressure here. Oh, man. He could have up Yeah, there, But oh, he up smashed out the shield. Oh, my. Just enough. Goodness. Oh, man. So, 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 so close.